The Yasuni National Park, located in the Ecuadorian Amazon rainforest, is an exceptionally unique biodiversity refuge. One hectare in Yasuni contains more species of trees and bushes than all of North America. Two isolated indigenous tribes, the Tagaeri and Taromenane, inhabit, together with the Huaurani, the Yasuni National Park. <laughs> Yasuni ITT, an initiative to change history. Ecuador has proposed to the world an innovative plan in order to confront the challenge posed by climate change to the future of mankind. Ecuador proposes to leave beneath the Yasuni National Park the 846 million barrels of oil that are within the ITT block. By doing so, the emission into the atmosphere of 407 million metric tons of carbon that would have been released by the burning of those fossil fuels are avoided. In exchange, Ecuador requests that the international community assume its corresponsibility by contributing no less than half of the revenues that would be received by selling these oil reserves. Direct benefits of this initiative the non-emission into the atmosphere of 407 million tons of CO2 and the guaranteed non-exploitation of these petroleum reserves. The conservation of the immense biological richness within the Yasuni National Park declared by UNESCO as a biosphere reserve along with the conservation of 39 additional national parks adding up to the most biologically diverse reserve on the planet. Respect for the cultures of the indigenous tribes who live in isolation within the boundaries of the Yasuni National Park. Reforestation of a million hectares. A decisive impulse to the country's transition from an extractive economy based on petroleum exploitation towards a more sustainable development model with broad use of renewable energy sources, respect for biodiversity and increased social equity. The Yasuni ITT Fund, the CGY's Certificates of Guarantee Yasuni ITT. The Certificate of Guarantee Yasuni ITT will become a financial instrument issued to the initiative's contributors and donors by the Ecuadorian state. It will serve as a guarantee that all the oil reserves that are now underground will remain there permanently. It is a non-interest accruing instrument with no maturity date, given its permanent nature. It could only be redeemed if the Ecuadorian government were to order the exploitation of oil within the ITT fields. All income generated by the international sales of the CGYs will be deposited in an international trust fund managed by the United Nations Development Programme. What investments will be made with the Yasuni ITT Fund? Effective conservation and preventive deforestation of 40 protected areas of Ecuador. Reforestation, forestation, natural regeneration and effective management of 1 million hectares of forests. The expansion of the actual renewable energy generation in Ecuador, taking advantage of its enormous resource potential in hydroelectric, geothermal and solar power. Improved social development of areas of influence of the Yasuni ITT initiative projects. Who is supporting the Yasuni ITT project? The Yasuni ITT fund will receive donations from different sources, contributions of countries from all over the world and international cooperation responsible corporations concerned with the future of mankind. 
philanthropists worried about the possible consequences of climate change. Small donors and global citizens who would access our website. An initiative to change history. The petroleum stays there, underground, forever. Covered by this unique biodiversity, protected by the Tagaeri and Tarumenane, by their ancestral rights. <laughs> by nature's harmony. Yasuni ITT.